Hello, welcome to One Minute Wiser. This is Christy Bridges, and tomorrow I'll tell you more about Daniel, but today I want to tell you about Richard. My husband is a genius. Yesterday, I was running errands and not finding what I was looking for, and the heat and the GPS sending me in wrong directions was adding to my irritation until I think at one point I screamed at the GPS and I said, Lord, what is wrong with me? This is ridiculous. But I still felt aggravated. And when I got home, I told my husband about it and then I added in something he had done that was annoying me. It wouldn't normally have bothered me and it was totally within his right, but it was one more thing on the pile. So he sat there and read and I shopped online for the things I couldn't find. And then at one point, he put on his swim trunks and said, hey, let's go play in the pool. Totally out of character for him, but it's something I love. And so we went out and had a good time. We laughed, he was affectionate, he was playful. It was so much fun. And then we came inside, we ordered dinner, we watched a movie, we ended up dancing at the end of the movie when the, the really good song came on. So he said, you know, when you got on to me, I felt like fighting back. But he had said, no, I'm gonna see what I can do to make her day better. And it worked out into the best day. This morning when I woke up, he said, man, last night was great. Best day ever. And you know, it was. Proverbs tells us, 17 verse 22, a cheerful heart is good medicine, but a broken spirit saps a person's strength. We are perfectly capable of breaking each other's spirits by fighting. We know exactly where to hit, but we don't, and he didn't. It says a cheerful heart is good medicine. Well, how often do we self-medicate with extra ice cream or beer or whatever, but refuse to let someone who loves us cheer us up? Well, that's silly. So God bless you guys today. Be wise in your relationships. See you tomorrow.